They are the dresses which remind us of another time and the woman who wore them. For Diana, Princess of Wales, clothes were very much part of her job. Gowns by some of the world's leading designers, worn by a princess to maximum effect, but for sale today to the highest bidder. At £40,000, sold. Ten dresses, originally sold by the princess for charity shortly before her death, were being auctioned for commercial gain. Prices range from £20,000 to £200,000 for the main item, the dress in which Diana danced with John Travolta after a dinner at the White House. The majority of the dresses were purchased by overseas bidders. However, three were bought by a British institution, and the Travolta dress will also be staying in Britain. So The John Travolta dress um, has gone to a British private collector who has never bought a dress in his life before, and it's a surprise present for his wife. The ten dresses fetched a total of rather more than £700,000 plus commission, proof of Diana's continuing value as a commercial commodity. One experienced observer found it all rather unsettling. I don't like the idea of them sort of just constantly coming up at auction, um, you know, just to the highest bidder. It just seems a little bit unstylish, I think. But, at least, as a result of today's auction, some of the dresses in which Diana delighted so many should become available for the public to view. Nicholas Witchell, BBC News.